Hey everyone, so the Operation Could Not Be Completed bug in Fallout 4 and Skyrim is still running rampant amongst us console users. I had made a video about how to work around this a couple months ago, but Bethesda recently dropped an update for both Fallout 4 and Skyrim that rendered that fix useless. It appears that they patched the workaround for the issue instead of patching the actual issue itself. But fear not my fellow console users, we have another way around this. This one was brought to my attention by many people in the comment section of my last fix video, and it honestly works very well and it's very fast. In fact, I think it's even faster than the last fix I shared. Quickly before we get into this, I'm displaying this on Xbox One on Fallout 4, but I believe we can safely assume this will work for Skyrim as well. I am also unaware if this works for PS4, or if this is even a thing on that console, but if you're on PS4 and this happens to work, please let me know in the comments. But for any further updates to this video, please refer to the pinned comment. So that said, let's get into it. So here we are at the mod menu. We choose the mod we want to download, and it says the operation cannot be completed. We know we have the space for the mod, we know we're connected to the internet, blah blah blah, yet it still won't let us download. So all you have to do from here is go Go to the Xbox menu, then scroll over to the settings tab. Once there, go to settings and click on it. By the way, I will be fast forwarding things to make this quick. Once in the settings, go down to network and choose network settings. Once there, go down to go offline and press it. Once offline, press go online, then wait for it to reconnect. Once reconnected, go back to your game and press download again. And just like that, we're back to normal. Now if you're on a wired connection, this will work exactly the same. This is a clip from a video a subscriber of mine had posted, and as you can see, it's a wired connection, and it's working just the same. The link to that video will be in the video description below if you want to go check it out. So if you're not having any luck doing things this way, you can try clicking on the disconnect wireless option in the settings menu as displayed here. Once disconnected, click on set up wireless network, find your Wi-Fi, and reconnect. Just make sure you know your password before doing this. Then if that isn't working, you can always try to hard reset your Xbox and sometimes that will work. Just make sure you're hard resetting properly. Just be aware that sometimes these methods won't work first try. Sometimes you'll need to do this a few times, maybe even more, but it should get the job done. So that will do it for fixing the operation could not be completed bug. Again. I'm not sure when Bethesda will fix this. I mean, hopefully sometime this decade, but who knows. But I hope this helps. And as always, thanks for watching.